A TSA agent died inside the Orlando International Airport Saturday morning in what police have dubbed an apparent suicide. At 9.30 a.m., an individual jumped from the Hyatt Regency Hotel into the atrium area of the airport, the Orlando Police Department said in a tweet. Advertisement A male in his 40s was found in critical condition and transported to the hospital where he was pronounced deceased. Authorities added that it was an isolated incident and that any reports of a suspicious vehicle are false. The Transportation Safety Administration in a statement confirmed the man had been a TSA employee. Our thoughts and prayers go out to the officer's family, friends and everyone in our TSA family, the agency said, but did not identify him. The Federal Aviation Administration briefly halted all flights to and from the airport, sparking massive delays and long lines at security checkpoints. Several people were scattered into the sterile area unscreened and noted that passengers would have to again go through security, TSA said that amid the incident. TSA will be rescreening passengers and will continue to work with the Orlando Police Department and Greater Orlando Aviation Authority to return operations to normal, the statement reads. Photos shared on social media shows confusion with crowds and lines building up in different areas of the airport Saturday morning. The airport reportedly resumed normal operations around midday. The tragic incident comes just days after TSA agents and other federal employees returned to work in wake of the month-long government shutdown. Transportation Security Administration Federal Aviation Administration